Jim and the young Rebecca. Hello, 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 guys. Hello, everybody. Hello. Welcome. Today's video. Today's video is going to be about how to be a game changer in event photography, right? Sit down, get comfortable, get yourself a rose. Oh, that was lit. Who's over lit? Okay, I've got my notes. Yes, we are. We are ready to general. <laughs> we may proceed. Whoa. Key points. Lighting is your bitch. Okay? Lighting is something you need to master. That is a definite. Why? Because when you're doing event photography, né? It's very, it's a tricky situation because you're always going into different locations. Go to these venues beforehand. Go beforehand. If the client calls you on the 21st saying they've got an event on the 30th, make sure by the 22nd, once that deposit is in, because we don't do no free work. Make sure once the deposit is in, you go into the venue, you check out the situation. You know, check how high the ceilings are. Try keep note about where the lights are coming from and think about how they're gonna affect your subjects, okay? What's gonna help you is coming through with a speed light. A speed light, there's many brands. There's Godox, there's Canon, there is Yung... Yung no, Yung no, Yung no. <laughs> It's okay, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay! Learn about these speed lights, all right, guys. You need to take the time to learn your equipment before you show up to an event. I can because we are also doing some of y'all are doing the most. So, we've covered that you need to consider your lighting. You also need to consider the venue you're in because that will inform the best positions to be taking your portraits in. Just tell people to move, guys. It's also okay to direct the people. A lot of the times, these, they are looking to be directed, okay? You're the professional here, so you should have the confidence. Nah. Another thing, please, please, guys, please make sure you're not taking photos of your clients from a low angle. Why? Because that just makes everyone look unflattering. You know, don't take it from a low angle, don't take it from a high angle. Make sure that your eye level, nah? If you're tall, come down. If you're short, try come up. Because that's gonna make the most flattering photos, guys. No joke, no joke. Tried and tested, I'm telling you, approved. So the formula for how to be a game changer in event photography is, is good lighting plus positioning. So that's where you place all the people. If there's one spot where the lighting is bomb, do what you have to do to make sure it's popping. Number three, guys. Number three, please never bring the stresses of your life into your work. I mean, you're doing photography because you love it, right? It's your passion, ne? 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 Come to the event in a good presentable manner be friendly to everybody Ooh, i can't stress this enough make sure you acquaint yourself with the event planner those are your friends event planners event managers you need to kiss their asses okay now i'm kidding <laughs> people will always want to work with someone that is professional and knows exactly what they're doing and also make sure you're smiling at the clients before you take their photos just coming on some ching 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 like take the time take the time to actually read people if you can see someone is shy be patient guys there's something about patience in this job that just pays off just watch the room People will naturally respond to the energy you give off. Sometimes you will get the ones who just don't want photos, but it's because they don't know your power. They don't know how great you are, and that's fine. They're gonna see the photos afterwards and they're gonna wanna book you. So, do your best at all times. Yeah, guys. 
I believe I'm done. Ne? If you've got any questions, please leave them in the comments below. <laughs> All the talking has just made me thirsty. I'm gonna go make myself another cup. And yeah, guys, thank you so much. I will check in the next one.